Hey, welcome back to Sin 1700. We have Jake and Sean here today from Oz Mutants. So welcome guys. Um, firstly, <laughs> how did the band form? Uh, um, <laughs> so uh, I moved to Geelong from up near Newcastle in New South Wales and uh, met Billy, who was like a little pimply 16 <laughs> year old kid. <laughs> and um, he was just like obsessed with the Rolling Stones and old 60s music and, uh, and then I don't know, we just decided to start a punk band and recruited Sean from Canberra and Mark from New Zealand and yeah, just started by doing a cassette that we made 30 of, like by dubbing every single one ourselves and that was going to be it and I don't know, we just kept on going. And how long have you guys been together now? That was 2011. Okay, and oh, do wow. you think that your music's developed as you guys have gotten older? Um, I think we've maybe like devolved okay like all right got, how, um, how so <laughs> uh, well like the first thing like pre sean and mark was like really good <laughs> oh, all right. like, That's how does that make you feel yeah. sean <laughs> um, i mean I, I think you know i didn't play on that record i didn't have anything to do with it so i can say it's probably the best one <laughs> yeah it's, <laughs> best known, it's probably the best one Aww. and from there it's kind of kind of like downhill until until it's the one where i wrote everything then there's and then it's like the most recent one, right? Sort of research. That's, that's yeah. kind of like Adam Sandler's Blend It, just going straight back. Yes. <laughs> that, that was off air before, wasn't it? <laughs> but I love that reference. <laughs> we, really uh, as a band, we're kind of similar to Adam Sandler. Adam Sandler, that's so Adam yeah. Sandler's movie career is kind of how we've <laughs> gone. <laughs> yeah. So, what's your music like now? Like, how would you describe it? Uh, <laughs> probably more of like an '80s hardcore influence. I think, um, like the first record Jake is talking about split personalities there are a lot of kind of more I guess uh, you know Ramones E Devo kind of stuff yeah uh, from Chrome yeah kind of weird noisy uh, new wavy punk kind of stuff but yeah I guess it's still kind of a little bit like that but maybe like more coming from an American hardcore kind of influence and Australian 70s punk kind of stuff yeah and you describe yourself that you're not the band of the future or the past. Why? Why do you say that? Do we say that? I you think said it. Was it. I reckon it's that there. was that would have been Press. one of the many henchmen that Some are behind the scenes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like for Vice magazine said it or something. I don't know. Yes. Yeah, okay, no comment. <laughs> no comment. No comment. So your newest album that was released out in April on the 26th is "The World in Handcuffs," and I've looked. Most of your songs are talking about the police or there it said that it's from the perspective of a police officer why did you use that as like inspiration just uh feels cool feels you know, cool oh yeah, I can about that. <laughs> yeah yeah okay we can so talk about uh critique all you want but uh you know put a put a cop uniform on feels good okay when you because did you start with the music first or the lyrics first either way did you wear a cop uniform it get into character, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh no, I never literally wore a cop uniform, <laughs> but, but I mean, you know, you know what I mean. Yeah, it feels good. Uh, lyrics first. Yep, yeah, okay. Power rush to your head. Yeah, it feels awesome. <laughs> Do you have like, because you say that it's a concept album? Are you looking to? you know, after this, you're creating more albums that are kind of following from this, or do you like to have separate entities on what you're feeling at the time of like when you're making it? Uh, well, what were we talking about at practice last night? What's the next concept? Concept. Oh album? yeah, uh, glorifying snitches. Yeah, yeah, like people who rat other people out. Oh you know? my gosh. Like that's They always get this bad rap. Like being you know, they're helping. Cool. They're helping uh, law enforcement. Yep. So we may Keep be expecting a series. whole, uh, like a whole Featuring. story for. Oh, well, you know, we, that type we want to. Uh, peek into other perspectives. Yeah. 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 Keep snitching video series. <laughs> <laughs> and so you guys, you guys have a gig tonight, right? Can you tell us yeah. where is it? What time? Um. Yeah, we're we're playing at Max Watts on Swanston Street. Um. At seven thirty with Ubik, Banana Gun, um, Primo, Civic, and Native Cats from Tasmania. Oh, amazing! Mm. Good. It's a bit multicultural. Yeah. Tasmanians in there, I like that. <laughs> Native cat's probably the big draw. I guess they're not playing up here as often as uh, all the other 
all the other acts, but yeah. yeah. Mm. Awesome. Well, we'll have more of a chat with you guys, but we're just going to go to a break right now. So thanks for listening.